On the sidewalk across the street from the high school, dozens of anti-DeVos protesters gathered in the hope that she would get their message. Hopefully show Betsy DeVos that there are people that need public schools that cannot afford private schools and charter schools, and that it's very important that we fund public education. Public school is very important, and uh, we don't agree with the current administration, so that's why we're here. But the other side gathered too, although in much smaller numbers. And she's been a school choice advocate uh, in her home state, and, and I'm here to say, hey, thank you, Betsy, for your stand. She needs some love, you know? I mean, she's doing her job everywhere she's going. She's getting made fun of, getting all these protesters. People love her. We're going to show her. Inside the school, DeVos sat in on a teacher's peer-to-peer -peer mentoring session, which every teacher attends every week. They share what's working in the classroom. The secretary was impressed. I think it was fabulous. Um, I, I hope that more schools and more teachers will emulate that process. Next, she watched in this and two other classrooms as teachers use different techniques to keep students engaged and learning. She was impressed here, too. Afterwards, she defended her ideas of school vouchers, giving students government funding to attend any school they or their parents choose. It, it would not impact a school like this, providing all of the students and all of the parents are happy with the school and how it's working for them. It's, it's really not a, an either or, it's really a both and situation. But critics don't like that idea because they worry it'll ruin the public school system and give private and religious schools an unfair advantage.